hello hello uh, i'm still playing my game of beat the washing machine so i did my sheet and a couple of rogue pillowcases i've hung them out on the line and now i'm just doing my pillows um and i thought what i would do is just do a very brief what i'm packing going to my boyfriend's i'm due on my period any day so i thought i'd just show you what i'm going to bring so first of all i've got this amazing i've just washed it it's nice and fresh and it's like a, it's a microfiber towel basically that you wear you'll see me in this quite a bit if i ever if i ever actually end up sharing some of the vlogs i've been doing you'll see, you'll see me in this really really handy it goes um it goes quite small and also very very light so um yeah i bought it on holiday to ireland last year and it was really good um <clears throat> CBD chocolate, CBD chocolate, orange flavour, always good. So I'm just going to put a few of these bits in here. Well, that's a low, very good dark chocolate, I might have that in a bit. <laughs> um, I have clip, I'm sure I'm going to put that in there. I think I put that in there to remind me to bring it, um, just for some food. I've got ibuprofen. I try not to take medication when I'm on, but um, you know I like to have it on standby in case. Um, more if I'm working, if I'm not working, I... <laughs> don't really feel a stress so I don't uh, need to take anything um I am gonna bring um this little cute oh good I thought I'd left like dirty ones in there I was like no um oh that's where my thong went <laughs> oh why was it in there I've been looking for this thong for bloody I was like Ash do you have my thong <laughs> I've got a cute little bra that goes with this I got like four sets from Primark and they're so they're so comfortable and they make me feel so sexy like it's just like a little triangle bra like it's not a non under uh, under wired bra um they're just so fucking hot I love them they're like really simple they're like a really nice mix of like they're actually like practical like you could wear them at the gym or just in your day-to-day -day. um and I'm just trying to see what they're made of and um they don't hurt <laughs> so that's what is good um, and they also just feel sexy, like they're just, mm. all right, okay, cool, I'm really happy about that, because I was like, I'm pretty annoyed I've lost it, okay, anyway, that was just hidden away in this bag, how cute is this bag, by the way, um, this is a set, I will, at some point I will sort out an Amazon storefront thingy-ma-bob, because I just want to be able to share how amazing and cute, these are super thin, they're really lightweight, they're really nice for like spring, summertime, they're nice in the winter and autumn as well, but I think my, um, I do still have some older pads that I had, but they're quite a bit thicker. And so, um, you could, if you're just, even if you're sitting down at work all day, if you're just, just getting a bit sweaty, um, but these are just so, they're so lightweight and um, they're really comfortable. So I'm gonna bring my pads, my reusable pads, pop them in this cute little bag. Oh, I think there's a few rogue ones there. I'm actually just gonna bring all of these because I like to, I think they came in either 10 or 12. Um, I'll probably do a, if it will be interesting, I'll do like a vlog at some point of like my favourite like period products. I mean, they're just like, they're really beautiful, right? You just want to feel like a goddess as much as you can when you're on your period. And they're just lovely. I think they all fit in the bag, but that's okay. Normally you just put like the dirty ones in the bag. So if you're out and about, you can just do a little swap, freshen up. Um, really, really nice. And yeah, I just, I just think they're just so, they're so great. I think you can do like a special folding of them. Like you could fold them like that and then they're all you know, if they're dirty, you can just be discreet, okay, or not be discreet, because you don't have to be, because we're allowed to do the thing that's natural every single month, you know, um, I have a few old pair of pants, I won't share those, um, they're just like good granny cotton pants that are really comfortable, they're like falling apart a little bit, but I just love them, so I have them in this, uh, in this box, um, these period pants are from M&S, there's some navy blue, there's a cute pink ones, and there's a grey pair. It was three of these uh, in a pack for 20 quid. Really happy with them. Um, they're kind of labelled. I think they're all they're all heavy, I think. I tend to just get heavy and then, you know, you can wear them wherever you're at in your cycle, can't you? So they are great. So I'm going to bring them. Those are really good for... Um, for bedtime sometimes i'll just wear them in the day but i'll wear like a reu reusable pad over them and then i will just change the reusable pad a little bit and then um i kind of do that actually I probably i would say i probably do that like in the evening like after work 
I might pop one of these on and have a shower or a bath, pop one of these on with a reusable pad and then when bedtime comes I can just whip the pad off, whack, whack it in the laundry and I'm already like in my period pants. I don't know why, sometimes it's just, well I do know why, I think sometimes when you're, you know, when you're on it just feel everything just feels like a lot more effort. <laughs> so any way I can make that easy whilst also being, you know, looking after myself is always good. I think I have some paracetamol in here as well. I'm gonna bring this. I do have a really cute mini one in here somewhere. Is it in here? Bags and bags and bags. Oh, these are my older pads. I mean, I've still got them because they're, you know, they're still in good condition, but they're a bit thicker. And they're, they're fine, but like, I kind of have them in here and then I've got them, you know, um, ready for like winter or anything. I feel like the, the pattern's kind of faded on them a little bit on this side, but they're still, they're pretty good. Um, and uh what else have i got in here i've got some more i think these are the the period pants that don't really work because so i think some of these are a bit small um i was getting period pants from primark and i got some that were really really good um and then i got some more but i was finding i had to get like really big like go not really bigger sizes but go big bigger 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 with the sizes because they would be really really tight and then of course you bloat when you're on your period so um i was just finding them really uncomfortable even with the m s ones to be fair i think i did size up um but they're still a little bit they're a bit snug and of course you know you, you do, well i bloat quite a bit when i'm on so i probably go up a dress size like the first couple of days anyway so it's a bit tricky um but anyway, I've got these in here because I am uh, losing weight at the moment and um, obviously, you know, you can use them for years and years and years. So um, I'm going to try them again, maybe towards the end of summer when I've hit some when I've hit some uh, measurement goals, not really weight goals, but measurement goals. I'm going to see if they're going to be comfortable. Um, and if not, then I might get rid of them just so that they're not taking up space. Um, but we'll see, we'll see. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna bring my hot water bottle because that is just the perfect size if I get cramps. And I don't know where the mini ones go. Oh, I think I do know where it is. Okay, but that's fine anyway. I'm not gonna bring the mini ones, so it's all good. Um, I do have some of this fleur de CBD. I don't know, Mandarin from France. Um, I've also got this CBD but when I had an allergic reaction under the Asira, I was just trying anything to help get rid of the eczema. Um, smells good. It's a body butter coconut infusion. I don't, I don't love it. I have to admit, it's from Tesco. I think it was like fifty gram, fifty milligram CBD. Yeah, I don't, I don't love it. I'll admit, gang. But I have, it's in here because it's got CBD in it. Um, this is uh, a nice little thing. I'm going to show you that, that later. Oh, these are just some dried rose petals. Um, what else have I got in here that I might want to bring? Diddly D. Oh, I have this heat thing. That's quite nice for your neck. Um, oh, I'm probably going to bring some tampons because I might be going swimming. Might be going swimming with my boys. I'll bring a couple because sometimes the applicators don't work, do they? And they're just annoying. So I'll grab them. Um, and I might just grab a, is that scented? I don't want, oh, I'm scented. Good. I'll bring a pad as well. Um, just in case for like a, you know, oh, I've got another little bag. Oh, this bag came with the other pads. I'll put these in there just to keep them together. Um, but yeah, I'll bring those just in case. I don't know if I want to wrap that on. I don't know, after swimming or something, but I don't know, it might be more convenient. It probably won't be. I don't know why I'm bringing it, but I feel like I need to bring it. So I'm going to bring it. Uh, <laughs> what else have I got? I'm not going to bring this. I really don't think I really need this. Um, I've got loads of bits in there, but I'm not gonna. I'll do a video where I share like my favorite products for when I'm on my period. Um, what else have I got? Oh, I do have some of these. Yeah, I do get some hydrate rehydration sachets. You know, like the Diorolite stuff. Because sometimes when I'm on, I just have all really have struggled to drink enough water. I just sometimes I just don't want to have anything in my body. <laughs> Um, so I do get a couple of these on standby because sometimes it will be like a couple of days and I'm like, oh man, I really like, I've hardly drunk any water. So, um, I kind of have those, obviously I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't have, I might have like a sachet, you know, over a day. Um, if I'm feeling, you know, especially if it's really warm or whatever, look at this little cute candle. Um, do I need anything from in here? Oh no, the bee's going to go on its there. Okay. What else have I got? Um, ylang, ylang. Let me finished. Okay. So, diddly diddly dee. I think, I 
that's it really of the bits i do have some tea <laughs> naturally being british and all i got some lovely nice tea in here haven't i um i don't know what that accent was <laughs> I'm gonna leave that for now. Right, uh, I always have this Shakti salve. Shout out to Moonbeam Daydream. Really, really good. A friend of mine, Freedom. Okay, oh, this is so nice. This is a, you know, she makes this by hand. It's cacao, ylang ylang, and vanilla. Beeswax, olive oil, cacao butter, dried flowers, and essential oils. So, so, so nice. Um, I still have this, like, <laughs> use, like a little bit. It lasts a really long time. Um, and it's just so nice. I tend to put this on my womb, maybe a little shoulder, breast massage, maybe foot massage. The places where I get kind of achy when I'm on. Um, I just love it. It feels really like indulgent and beautiful. Um, I seem to have, do I want to just get rid of these boxes? I'll keep that box. Let's just take the paracetamol. Oh, is that? Oh, they're both, they're just different brands right i'm gonna put this in here just to keep it all together i'll leave the cbd thingy oh i also have this that i got when i lived in cornwall i'm doing aroma yoga with cbd so 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 nice cbd massage oil again that is if i've got cramps i'll use that i don't find this helps with cramps um but i just i just it makes me feel really like just very in my divine feminine um, I just realised it's a gorgeous, gorgeous scent. So often I'll, I'll kind of massage this on and then a little bit later I'll put this on. Um, but that's, I'd say that for me, that feels more like ritualistic, um, whereas this is more like pain management, basically. Um, so I'm going to put this in here. I also have this little, I got this from like, it must have been from like a little set years ago, I think from the body shop, but it's a massager, a massage pool, and I just roll my feet on it. Um, I get really achy arches when I'm due on slash on. Um, don't know why. There's a lot of links between feet and the pelvic bowl, so maybe that's why. Right, I'm gonna put those in there. Um, and then, oh, I've also got my pink, my pink PJs. This is actually my leisure wear. Um, it's a top, a long sleeve top and pantaloons from Primark. Um, I'm actually gonna pack those in there because they're nice just for lounging around in the day a little bit. Um, they're a matching set and I just feel like they look quite cute. It actually looks really nice with this sweater. So I'm gonna bring this little very light jumper with me as well. It's got cute, cute uh, patterns on the back. So if it's a little bit chilly, I tend to just kind of layer those bits. Um, yeah, it's nice. I like to I like to be able to layer with those. And it's weird weather at the moment. It's kind of like spring, but it's England. So it's like today is sunny, but it might, it's very cloudy. So it might pour down with rain. I find it, I kind of just dislike that. It's hard to like pack when you know, <laughs> when you don't know how the weather's going to be. Um, this is going to go in here and I'll grab a couple of pairs of those granny pants as well. <laughs> so that is my here there's also a big uh, there's a big book at the bottom of there and some protein not protein powders some pre-workout powder as well um and that was all just from this little box i'm gonna slide that back in here for new um i do sometimes bring a few oils but i think my oils are already in my bag already i think yeah i've got some geranium ylang ylang oil I put that over there because i'm actually gonna have a shower later so i don't want to pack that yet and then there was one other thing what else was it? What was the other thing? Sorshi. Sorshi McGee. Um, I can't remember what the other thing was. I thought there was something else I was going to say, but it's gone from my brain. So, yeah. Really glad I found that thong and it's clean. So, <laughs> always good. Um, yeah, there was something else, but I can't remember. It doesn't matter. I'm sure it'll be fine. Um, anyway, this was a 14 minute thing of what I'm packing for boyfriends. So yeah, I hope that was useful for you. But I will do like an actual thing of uh, period products because I feel like, yeah, it's just handy to handy to know. So this is either going to go in my vlog that I'm doing for today um, or I might do it as a separate thing because it is like a 15 minute video. So it kind of depends on the space. <laughs> Basically, it depends if, uh, if my iPhone lets me transfer it to my iPad <laughs> or not. Anyway, um, is that the laundry load just go can't be no anyway okay i'm gonna crack on now with the next part of my day